Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we shall make use of Venn diagrams to illustrate the subset of a universal set and a complement of a set. So first, let us learn what Venn diagrams are. Relationship between finite number of sets can be represented by means of diagrams known as Venn diagrams. In Venn diagrams, universal sets are usually represented by interior of rectangles And the subsets of the universal set are represented by interior of circles. Now consider a universal set Xi with elements A, B, C, D, E, F and its subset A with elements a, B, C. Let us learn steps to draw a Venn diagram. First is draw a rectangle to represent the given universal set Xi. So we have drawn this rectangle and it represents the universal set Xi. Next step is then draw a circle inside this rectangle to represent subset A of Xi. So we have drawn a circle inside this rectangle and it represents subset A of Xi. Now in the third step, we write the elements of A that is A, B, C inside the drawn circle so we will write the elements A, B, C inside the circle in the last step write the remaining elements of Xi that is DEF outside the circle but inside the rectangle. So we will write the remaining elements of Xi that is DEF 
in this region which is outside the circle but inside the rectangle so this is the venn diagram when the universal set xi and its subset a is given to us now we know that the complement of the given set is the set of elements in the universal set other than the given set so this portion which is outside this given circle which represents set a but inside this rectangle which represents the universal set xi represents complement of the set a since it contains elements which are in xi but not in a so a complement is represented by the shaded portion and it contains the elements d e f that is complement of a is equal to the set containing the elements d e f so in this session we learnt about venn diagrams and steps to draw a venn diagram with this we end our session hope you enjoyed the session